Hey, what's up everybody? Have you ever made a painting and you love how the background's turning out, but you don't want to mess up the details? In this video, I'm going to show you a tip that I use to make sure that your details and your painting turn out exactly how you want it to be. Check it out. So this painting here, I did this gradient with like some waves starting to build, and I really like how it turned out, but I want to add a boat here in the middle. But I didn't want to kind of sketch in the boat and mess up the background. So what I do is this chalk transfer technique and I am able to transfer the drawing exactly where I want it to be and that way the background doesn't get messed up. So it goes like this. The first thing I do, I make a sketch drawing of the boat that I wanted to put into the painting. And this could be anything for you, it could be a building, it could be a person, but you do a sketch first, any size, in a sketchbook to work out all the details, the perspectives, shadowing everything on a sketchbook and that way it's exactly how you want it to be. The next thing I do is I scan that sketch and then I trace it on the computer to kind of get the rough outline of the boat exactly how I want it to be and then I print out that rough outline to be the exact size that I need it to be for the painting. Then I take that printout, I tape it together to be the right size and then I cover the back of the drawing with chalk. And you make sure that you pick a color that is contrasting to the color of your painting. And then lastly, I'll take the drawing, put it where I need it to be. And you can, you can tape it if you want, but I find that I can just hold it with my hands, put it where I need it to be, and then I do a draw, a, and then I trace it with a pen, trace the lines with a pen, and then I have an exact drawing of my sketch right where I need it to be, the proportions and the size are exactly how I need them to be for the painting. And then I go in and paint. All these extra little chalk lines, if there's anything left over that you don't cover with the paint, you just wipe off once the paint dries. All right, I hope you like that quick tip. I hope it helps you in your next painting. And now I'm going to take the rest of the video and just finish this painting up. I hope you enjoyed this video. Leave me a comment below if you want the next painting I do to be just stormy waves or with boats. So comment below either storms or boats. All right, thanks a lot and enjoy the rest of the video. Hey everybody, I hope you enjoyed that video. Just a review to transfer your sketch onto your painting. Just take your sketch, blow it up on a copy machine, scan it on a computer, however you need to do, get it on a piece of paper, cover the back with chalk, put it on the painting, and trace over the top, and then you have a transfer of your sketch to go right on top of your painting. I hope that works for you. Um, leave a comment if you have any more questions, and hit the like button if you liked it. And hit the dislike button if you, well, if you disliked it. All right, see you next week. Thanks.